Yes, we are gearing you up for your holiday parties with a couple of drinks that will definitely impress your guests. upon us and Nick Spinks from Artisan on Alamo Distillery is here with some great fall inspired drinks. Yes. Yes. Okay. So we're going to make uh, two cocktails today. One out of vodka with Texas Pride Vodka handmade right here mm -hmm. and another one with our new bourbon. So Ooh. we're going to start out with a bell pepper martini for the for the vodka one. So okay. what we're going to do is we're going to in our shaker and uh -huh. stuff we're going to muddle some mint. Uh, in this glass here go ahead and put the uh, couple bell peppers both okay. uh, the uh, yellow and the red. Okay. And then muddle those down. Okay. And if you don't have a muddler, you can use a broom handle. Just don't hit the ceiling. <laughs> just don't hit the ceiling. <laughs> <laughs> but you're just trying to get the oils and extract the oils out. So you just don't have to make a salsa out of it or anything like that. Okay. So but this will give it a little bit of a kick, right? Yeah, well, it's not going to spice it up or anything. Right. Yeah. I and mean, bell peppers aren't really that right. spicy. If you do want it spicy, put a jalapeno in there. Okay. It's really good. Okay. So we're going to do a lemon infusion. So okay. go ahead and do a four count of that in, in, in here. In here. Okay. Yeah. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Okay. okay. And then let's do a four count of the Texas Pride vodka. Okay. So one, two. Or just keep three, on going as much four, as you want. Four, five, six. <laughs> we like six. Okay. Put <laughs> this into the shaker. Okay. Okay. All the way over. And then I've rimmed this with uh, tahini, you know, which is the uh, seasoning salt. Now this you can either use a strainer or if you're good you can separate it here. Which I'm glad you're doing it. <laughs> it's, it, it actually is real easy. Is it? Because I practice. feel like I would make a mess. No, no, it's okay. just practice. So, okay. on that. Go. So that's a really nice refreshing drink. Mm. So, let's see how it turned out. Yes, he's going to have to taste it for me. <laughs> it turned out very well. Oh, so the how I create these is find, you find fall right. fruits and vegetables and everything and you just create it into a cocktail. Think of it as um, like you would cook. Mm -hmm. So, Second one we're going to do is a peach old fashioned. And this is with the new bourbon. This is with the new bourbon, uh, Bear Ridge bourbon. Okay. So it's pretty much the same thing as a uh, uh, old fashioned without the orange. We're going to use peach. Okay. So go ahead and take a, two or three slices of peach and put okay. it in this glass here. Okay. Go ahead and do one of the cherries. One now I of use the I use marinade. Go ahead and muddle that up. Mm -hmm. I use a marinated cherry and marinate that for about six weeks in my vodka. So they look like cherries. Oh. Oh, but they're so loaded they're, cherries. They're loaded cherries, yeah. <laughs> there so, we go. We call them spiked cherries. <laughs> spiked cherries, yeah. So I'm sorry about that. Mm -hmm. And then just to make it a little sweet, we can do a, a this is equivalent to about a um, sugar cube. Okay. So it's easier to dissolve. Mm -hmm. So a splash of aromatic bitters, mm -hmm. which is, there you go. Okay. And then do a five count or six count of the bourbon. Right. One, two, three, four, five, okay. and a half. Some okay. people do a little bit of simple syrup on this. I, I tend not to. If you do want a little bit sweeter, you can do that. So you just mix it up. You don't have to shake it. Right. And then we just pour it, pour over, it over the ice. There so, we and we use cubed ice on that. Oh my really gosh, look at how pretty that is. The bourbon is really uh, smooth. Okay. So. Perfect. Well, here, hold on. Wait. Here we go. In three, two, one. Well, cheers. Yay. Okay, so you do tours here, right? Yes. At Artisan on Alamo. I do tours at 4 o'clock and 7 o'clock, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Mm -hmm. We are open for happy hour all Thursday and Friday and Saturday from 5 to 8. All right. For more information on Nick Spinks and Artisan on Alamo Distillery and these drinks, just head to our website, salive.com, and click on the As Seen on SA Live tab. All right. Well, you can get a free tour mm -hmm. um, over there at Artisan on Alamo if you email Nick at artisanonalamo.com. And also, he will be having a second anniversary party. Say, it's a whole weekend already. party. Two years. Yes. November 15th to the 17th.